<laughs> you want to go down to the beach and make a fire? Yeah. All right, let's go. We're going to go make a fire and we're actually going to go make some s'mores. Fabi and Yana are from Germany, so hey. I don't know if you guys know what s'mores are. But... Never heard of it. Never, Never heard, heard of it? No. no, we don't have it. It's the perfect time of day to have a little bonfire, watch the sunset. Hershey's actually reached out to us and wanted to sponsor this video. I absolutely love making s'mores on camping trips with my family or even in our kitchen at home sometimes. All you really need is a candle and some friends and you've got yourself a perfect recipe for some s'mores. I can't wait to show these guys what they've been missing out on their whole life. Obviously, you gotta use Hershey's. Thanks for sponsoring this video, Hershey's. You gotta use their chocolate bars, but you take a graham cracker, you take a half of a Hershey's bar, put it on your graham cracker, then you take a marshmallow, and you put the marshmallow over the fire. There's a handful of different ways that people like to roast their marshmallows. I'm a coals guy. I like to get close to the coals. I like to let the marshmallow swell and turn a nice soft brown. Ali is the type of person that just puts it in the fire, it lights on fire, it flames up, it turns black, she blows it off, and like some people That's love that. Well. It's I'm the not... best method. <laughs> For everybody out there that knows it's the best method, help me out in the comments, come on. And then you take the marshmallow when it's piping hot, you put it on top of the chocolate that's on top of your graham cracker, you take one more graham cracker, you make a little sandwich. I'm definitely not a professional here. There's no wrong way to eat a s'mores. Is there not? Mm -hmm. No. Nope. All right. Just go for it. All right, Fabi, let's see what you got. I'm, I'm going to try to copy trend here. <laughs> he can see this golden brown deliciousness Aww. already. Careful, Frank. I can also see that that's years of experience and grilling <laughs> marshmallows. See how the marshmallow cream goos out? Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's definitely more the professional than mine. Oh. Mission accomplished. All right. All right. Nice yeah, what's up? David. Nice to meet you. What's your name, man? Trent. Trent. Nice to meet you, Trent. That was delicious. I'm so glad we were able to do that. Pick up s'mores ingredients this summer so that you guys can get out there and enjoy connecting with family, friends. Maybe even some strangers. Thanks again to Hershey's for sponsoring this video. And I'm sure you guys have all been wondering thus far, how did we even get here? Oh, is that a freaker boy? How are you doing? I was thinking of making you coffee this morning. Oh, really? Would you like that? Yay. Pretty complicated. Oh, I don't know if I can do it. Let's see if you can handle it. Wow. Okay. I got that. <laughs> Press that coffee down like it owes you money. You owe me money. Oh my god. That's why I make coffee every day. <laughs> oh, I tapped it too hard. See the pressure gauge? It should be in the gray. There's no pressure. Yeah. No pressure comes when you don't tamp it hard enough. The easy part's over. Now you just gotta texture the milk. <laughs> I'm trying to help, dude. I was trying to tell you how to set it. You're not even tilting the cup away from you. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, magnificent. Mm -hmm. Delicious. <laughs> Everyone has a roll. And just because I'm not the very best latte maker in this van doesn't mean I'm not gonna stop practicing doesn't mean I'm gonna stop practicing. Doesn't mean I'm gonna stop practicing. I'm gonna keep practicing, I'm gonna get better. We're actually heading out of here in a few minutes, but I wanted to show you something that I actually haven't seen yet. Trent told me about them the other day, he saw them. Hey there, big mama. Hey there, big mama. It's okay, man. Get a cute they are. Oh, look at them. 
teeny, tiny puppy. And this is Rocky. Oh, Rocky. He was, he was playing with Frank. Doesn't that make you want to take a puppy home? Yeah. Oh, those puppies just need some love. I love puppies. <laughs> now, we're actually getting on the road, and we're gonna meet up with some friends that you guys probably remember from the Don't Stop Belizing series. One of our favorite things about travel and this lifestyle is that we're constantly meeting new people and new friends on the road. You never know if or when you're gonna see these people again, so when you do have the opportunity to reconnect later down the road, it's really exciting. And today, we have that opportunity. Really excited to drive down to Popoyo. It's where our friends right on the wild side are actually managing a hostel or a bed and breakfast. And they have been, made their way south from Belize all the way down here to Nicaragua. And then when it started raining, I think they kind of got sick of the rain and they ended up posting up shop and now they manage this little bed and breakfast, which is totally awesome. So we're gonna go see them. It's right on the beach. It's where there's amazing surfing in Nicaragua. So we're gonna get a surf, we're gonna get a hangout, we're gonna make a bonfire. It's gonna be awesome. Here's the gas station. So I plugged in a gas station on the GPS. We routed directly there. It was on the way, not a problem at all. We pulled up and this is what it looks like. These friendly people are gonna help us fill up. Just gonna fill up enough to get us back on the road, get us to our destination, and maybe we'll find another probably cheaper gas station in town. Onward to Papoyo. Well, you know, just your uh, daily river crossing here in Nicaragua. But if these two chicks on a motorcycle can do it, I feel like Pamela could probably do it. All right, Pamela, let's go. Oh, this is, oh my God. <laughs> it's pretty, uh, it's pretty interesting actually, because like once we entered Nicaragua and we were driving on like the Pan American Highway, the highway was like awesome. One of the best highways we've been on in Central America as far as road quality goes and like the pavement and everything. And most of the highways here have been like immaculate. But then there's roads that have just never been paved and they're like riddled with potholes and bumpy and they've got rivers running through them or there's big water runoff ruts. It's just one extreme or the other. Yeah, it's just like it is. It's one extreme or the other. It's like either excellent or treacherous. <laughs> That's how I like to live my life. Yeah, one, one side of the spectrum or the other. Here we go again. This is just a crick. Just a crick. The other one was a river, this one's a crick. There it is. Oh boy, maybe just pull up on the, on the side. Hello. Amigos. Ah. <laughs> What's Hi. up? Good, how are you? It's so Hi. good to see you. Oh. How are you? Good I, was, I wasn't sure if that was your back. <laughs> Hi! Hi! How's it going? Where's, this is beautiful! Yeah, isn't it? Are you loving it? Yeah, yeah. very much. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Good! Yeah, how about that huge wow. bag with a palm leaf? This is so cool! So this is upstairs master bedroom kind of. But you can sleep here with up to five people. It's an open house, actually, so you don't need air conditioning here. Yeah. A bit of a fan and you always have cool, Yeah, it feels great. It's really nice yeah. in here. And the kitchen is like a shared kitchen between the two. Um, oh, this is beautiful. So good to see those guys. I know. Food, surfing, the dogs all get to play together. The weather's looking pretty good. You remember your friend? That's Lola. It's a different Lola. Yeah. We're getting kind of settled in here at the Vibra guest house with our friends down on Fabi. And we get to do something here that we don't normally get to do, and that's use a kitchen! A full size kitchen. <laughs> We're gonna whip up some eggs. They're actually gonna do some acai bowls. Let's get started. Like simple, clean, healthy, fresh meals, fresh basil, 
and be able to spend time right here on the beach with great friends. Lunch or brunch or breakfast, whichever one that was, it was absolutely delicious. Excellent treatment here from Yana and Fabi. But now that we're here in Popoyo, it's actually a really great place to surf. So I'll throw on my rash guard, grab the surfboard, and head down to the breaks. So we're back here and we are making a little bit of dinner. We got Allie over here, she's dicing the garlic. <laughs> Bobby's over here looking extra suave right now after the shower. <laughs> suave. <laughs> the, the slick back here. Making squash with nuts. What are you making? I'm topping pumpkin. Pumpkin? So we're gonna roast that pumpkin. The nuts are roasted already. And we're gonna make a delicious pumpkin pesto. Pumpkin pesto. A pumpkin pesto. Pesto. <laughs> Are you sauteing up? Is that pumpkin? Yeah, I'm trying not to burn the garlic. Donna and Fabi have a herb garden here, and we've been tasked with going to pick some basil. Who's lots of basil? Oh yeah, that's all basil, no? The thing is, you gotta pick it without destroying the little leaves underneath. So then so it'll it can keep grow growing? Back. Wow. Yes. I had no idea. I would've just came out and like taken the whole plant. <laughs> Who'd have thunk? Pumpkin pesto. You never heard of that? I never heard of that. No, I thought this, I thought this was your creation. It was. <laughs> oh, it's so good. I'm I'm amazed. This looks really delicious. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Thank you. This is Cheers. awesome. We met in Belize. Yeah. We're here in Nicaragua. It's like I honestly didn't even know we would. Three countries in between. Yeah. Yeah. Great. I didn't even know if we would make it to Nicaragua. <laughs> and now here we are. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> friends on the road are something special. Let's We're gonna see. dig in. We've had such a great day hanging out with our friends, Yana and Fabi. Thanks guys. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, hit the notification bell so that you can be notified every time we release a new video. Enjoy the rest of your evening and we'll talk to you soon guys. See you guys on the next one. Bye!